Hi guys, welcome to 31 Days of Tarot, day <clears throat> nine. I skipped yesterday's because I didn't have an answer for that one. Um, I don't have anything on my wish list and I really don't plan on having anything on my wish list this year um, unless something amazing comes up. <laughs> other than because, oh, I got like an eyelash in my eye. Um, other than because I am not planning on spending crazy amounts of money on tarot this year like I did last year. I'm on a budget and, um, you know, I do plan on buying decks for the sake of <clears throat> needing to, you know, do that for my little tarot biz. But um, I don't want to go hog wild with decks. I really actually want to focus more with appreciating what I already have in my collection. So there is nothing on my wish list. Now for day nine, my tarot goals for 2019, um, <clears throat> the main goal is to just embrace the fact that I have my own tarot room, to embrace the fact that I can do, you know, delivery times for my readings much shorter, like probably cutting it in half. Um, I plan on, like I said, working with more of the decks in my collection versus buying new stuff. Um, and then another major goal is I would like to eventually teach a tarot class online. So that is going to be like the ultimate goal, but, um, or one of the ultimate goals, <laughs> but, um, it may not happen for another couple months cause I need to prepare all of that. <clears throat> um, I want to open up more FaceTime sessions. I want to continue doing my in-person sessions, but I feel like I'm going to be doing more, um, FaceTime sessions than in person because of where I live now. Um, but I just really want to like get comfortable with utilizing my tarot room and just enjoying, you know, that I have this space and that I have certain days of the week that I can devote completely to my practice. So, um, very simple goals, you know, obviously I want to focus on maintaining sales and, you know, making some new clients and being more present on my social media. Like those are all goals, but, um, I guess it's just little by little, just making sure I stay active and being present and loving what I do and doing it for the sole purpose because I want to help people. So with that said, you guys, that is just the quick and easy 2019 goals of tarot, <laughs> tarot goals for 2019. Um, I don't want to make it just crazy, you know, impossible, setting impossible goals, but I just want to keep it realistic and I really just want to enjoy um, at least the next few months, I just want to enjoy the fact that I have my own tarot reading space and then we'll go from there and we'll bring in like some of the bigger ideas and stuff. But yeah, that is it, you guys. So I will catch you later. I will catch you for tomorrow's um, prompt for day 10 and have a good day. Bye, guys.